all this has been totally unexpected. To receive this award is to remind me that 24 years ago, I took on duties from which I shall never be relieved. But you have given me the strength to carry on. You have showed me tonight that I shall not be alone as I go about the discharging of my duties. So many people have asked me what it feels like to come out of Burma for the first time in 24 years. This journey actually started with a short trip to Thailand a couple of weeks ago. And now I've been to Switzerland, to Norway, and I'm here this evening in Ireland. And now I know the answer when, if people, when people ask me, how does it feel? Moving is the word. By moving, I mean a stirring of the heart, as well as an impetus towards the goal, a, a new impetus towards goal that we've been looking to for the last 24 years. You have helped us greatly. I have to confess that I never knew how many people cared for us and for our cause until I started out on this journey, which started in Thailand, as I said, a couple of weeks ago. I was amazed and deeply touched and moved by the warmth that the Thais showed, that they demonstrated for me and for my cause. And again, along this journey to the West, in Switzerland, in Norway, and now here in Ireland, I've discovered how much more people care. I had not expected this. I had not known how much they cared. This has come as a surprise to me and a very moving one. I feel very close to you. The British used to refer to the Burmese as the Irish of the East. <laughs> we, we never quite understood why. Uh, some said it was because we never gave them any peace and we were very rebellious. And others said, others said that it was because um, our men liked their drink and we were all rather superstitious. <laughs> but for whatever reason, tonight I feel proud to be your Eastern counterpart. I'm very happy to be an Irish of the East. Throughout these years, you and others like you, Amnesty International and other organizations like Amnesty International, have helped us to keep our small wick of self-respect alight. You have helped us to keep the light. And we hope that you will be with us in the years to come, that you will be able to join us in our dreams and not take either your eyes or your mind off us, and that you will help us to be the country where hope and history merges. Thank you.